Today we're making aloe vera oil. <laughs> so I'm going to use some aloe powder that I have made before and I have a video on my channel also for making aloe powder. We're making aloe oil today. Of course you can make aloe oil with already bought store-bought aloe powder but if you want to make aloe powder this is the process that I use. I just sliced up my aloe vera leaf then I left it to dry for a few days and then I ground the leaves the dried leaves in a coffee grinder so here is the aloe powder I left the oil to rest overnight so it can also have some time to settle and because of that I actually realized I don't need a muslin cloth to strain the oil and I can just pour the oil off because the sediment of the fenugreek powder and aloe powder actually uh, settled at the bottom and all the oil remained at the top and it was very easy to pour off everything else was left behind and it worked out perfectly. We have some leftover from the fenugreek and the aloe powder. And of course, by now, if you are new to my channel or if you've been here a while, you know that I don't throw these away. I keep these for my deep conditioning masks. Feel free to let me know in the comments below what you'll do with this leftover powder. And also let me know if you will make this aloe vera oil. There you have it. This is the aloe oil and y'all this is beautiful. Look at took on the colors of the aloe powder which were green. Yeah, <laughs> now it's sort of an olive green, dark green because our olive oil started off yellow. But y'all if you're going to try this aloe oil let me know in the comments below and I cannot wait to hear from you.